Good morning, Mr. President. Good morning. Good morning. to be here. Small talk for a while, while some three waves of photography. You've been you, you remember that. That's right. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. How did we go? Glad to see you, sir. Glad to see you again. All right. Where do we sit? say that it's your economic policies that caused that downturn on Wall Street yesterday. Yes, it's funny, Bill, that I couldn't understand at the beginning that creating 14 million new jobs, eliminating inflation, or virtually eliminating it, bringing it down, and lowering interest rates, increasing the prosperity of the people, uh, I just wouldn't understand that that could hurt the stock market. What worries would you have for investors today, Mr. President? Well, we're in constant consultations. I think everyone has been caught by surprise in this. And uh, it is true that at this point of the day, the market is a far better situation than it was yesterday at this time, with about the same number of uh, sales of stock, or trading of stock. Uh, but uh, we're, we're, I'm very pleased and gratified with the action that has been taken so far by the uh, Federal Reserve Board and the fact that uh, two of the major banks have lowered their interest rates. Are you having meetings here today with your economic advisors, Mr. Baker? I can't speak to that, uh, Bill, right now. I do know that we've been in continuous consultations, and many times they, they come up without advanced scheduling. Well, Mr. President, some on Wall Street said they want some leadership from the White House. They want some action on the budget deficit. They want to calm the fears about the Persian Gulf. What do you have to say to them? Is there going to be any action by this administration, or are you set to just let the market run its course at this point? Well, as I told you, we are consulting uh, continuously and have been uh, since this started with uh, others in our own administration, but also outside forces. With regard to the deficit, then why don't they fix the blame as I have tried to where it belongs, on the legislature, which has gone on now for more than 50 years, defending deficit spending. Thank you. This way, please. Cameras. Wait, when's the news coming? When's the news coming? 
thought you'd know. I don't know. I know that it's soon. This way. Good job. Men in the world. <laughs> I don't know about the Prime Minister, but you just made my day. <laughs> I told you our press would be nicer than yours. Would you like to go to work in our press court? <laughs> Yeah, that's it. Uh, all having to do with the excellent relationship exists between our two countries. Thank you very much. I think we're on the right track. And I want to reiterate my strong support for India's integrity. We share an abhorrence of terrorism, and I'm glad we've been able to cooperate in combating the 
seek terrorists who are seeking to use our country as a base. Delighted to receive your letter also stating India's desire to purchase a supercomputer for monsoon research. And I have already told the Prime Minister we should proceed with cooperation on aspects of your like combat aircraft. Well, I have mentioned that in there, that, that project also. But you must also have an agenda there that I should pause myself and uh, Thank you, Mr. President. Yeah, thank you, Mr. Schumer, for the invitation that you extended. It's a great pleasure to be in the United States and to have this opportunity to meet with you again. Especially as you have so many problems and preoccupations just during these days. We appreciate your taking this time. Thank you. The visit, in many ways, although very brief, is very timely. We had, two years ago, set out on a course of action to bring the two countries closer together. And I'm very glad that today we can look back and answer those very skeptical comments that had come at that time. We have achieved everything that we set out to do, and it's time to lay out a new agenda for us to work out, to move ahead on. I believe that our two groups have already been talking to each other, and much of that has already been done. We appreciate again the cooperation and understanding that we have received.
Every once in a while, my past life catches up with me. So, with this being very important to be on, I had the opportunity to speak about the motion picture films. <laughs> 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 